and welcome back to my channel. So right here, I do have a Walmart haul for you guys. In this transaction, I took advantage of some Ibotta rebates and I also redeemed some points over on my Fetch Rewards account so that I can redeem for a $10 Walmart gift card. So Fetch Rewards did pay for some of my order. And so before I get into these deals, if you guys are watching this video and you are currently not subscribed to me, I would really appreciate if you would consider subscribing along with hitting that notification bell so that you will be aware of each and every time I upload a video. So I'm going to go ahead and get into these deals. So if you guys are interested, then just keep on watching. Okay, you guys. So in this transaction right here, my goal was to reach this $5 bonus and it was get $5 back when you redeem 12 offers. And I had already redeemed three in the past. And so I needed nine more offers to redeem. So for this transaction, that's all I needed to grab when I went in the store. So these are the different items that I got. So as you can see, I have some Camp Bell's Slow Kettle Soup right here. I have some Pringles Wavy, some Paste Picante Sauce, some cheez -It Snaps, some Sweet Tart Ropes. I have the three pack of renews -its. I have five individual renews -its, a package of Huggies Wipes, a smaller pack of Huggies Wipes, this Skin to Mint Razor, and then this right here had to be a second transaction, and I'm going to tell you guys why. But before I do that, let me just go ahead and tell you guys the deals first. Okay, so with the Campbell's Slow Kettle Soup, so this is priced at my store for $2.63. I did print a $0.75 cent off coupon from coupons.com so they brought the total down to just a dollar and 88 cents for this now i had an issue with this you guys because before i go into walgreens especially when i'm doing ibotta i'm sorry not walgreens but walmart especially when i'm doing ibotta offers i make sure that my rebates are still available before i go in the store because there have been multiple times where i went in the store and my rebates just completely disappeared and so that is what happened with this right here. So I checked before I went to the store and there was a 75 cent rebate offer on this as well. But when I got to the car, I couldn't find it. I couldn't find it anywhere. So I don't know, like it just completely disappeared. So I paid 188 for this, but it should have been 75 cents cheaper. And also it messed up my transaction because remember I was going in the store to get nine items because that's what I needed to reach the $5 bonus. And because this didn't, didn't come up, I only got back eight offers and that's why I had to go back in the store to get this. So the next item I have right here are the Pringles Wavy. And so these are priced at my store for a dollar and thirty-seven cents. Ibotta does have a rebate back for a dollar and forty-four cents back, which made this box of Pringles completely free plus a seven-cent money maker. Now, at your store, these may actually be the price that Ibotta has it for, which is a dollar and forty-four cents. So you will pay one forty-four, and you will submit your receipt to Ibotta and get it back a dollar and forty-four, which will make it free. But mine's were just a few, a few cents cheaper. So free plus a seven cents money maker. And then right here, I have the Pace Picante sauce. And this is priced at my store for $1.98. I did use a 50 cent off of one printable coupon that I printed from coupons.com. So that brought the price down to $1.48. And then Ibotta also has a 25 cent rebate back. So with using that 25 cent rebate, it brought the total down to just $1.23 for this Pace Picante sauce. And then right here, I have the Cheez-It Snaps. These are priced at my store for $2.42. Ibotta does have a rebate back for $0.75. Cents. So with using that rebate, it brought the total down to just $1.67 for this bag of Cheez-Its. And this is the, sour, the Cheddar Sour Cream and Onion flavor. So right here with the Sweet Tart Ropes, these are priced at my store for $2.63. Ibotta does have a rebate back for $0.75. Cents. So when I use that rebate from my bottle, it brings the total down to just 88 cents. Back there, I have a three pack of the Renews It um, Air Fresheners. So that is priced at my store for $2.62. Ibotta does have a rebate back for a dollar. So with using that rebate from my dollar from Ibotta, it brought the total down to just a dollar and sixty-two cents for all three, or fifty-four cents each. And that is the lavender, the lavender scent. And then right here, I got five individual Renews It air fresheners, and these are priced at my store for 87 cents. So I, and I had to purchase five. 
because Ibotta has a rebate back to where you can receive $2 back when you purchase five. So they are priced at 87 cents. So 87 times five is 4.35 minus the $2 that I got back from Ibotta brought my total down to just $2.35 for all five or 47 cents each. And as I say all the time, I like these because I do price these in my bundles. So I have been stocking up each and every time I bought a reset the offer on these. So 47 cents each. And then right here for the Huggy Swipes, this is the 56, 56 count. And these are priced at my store for $1.78. If you have Fetch Rewards, Fetch Rewards does have a rebate back to where you can receive 1,500 points, which is $1.50. So 178 in store, submit your receipt to Fetch Rewards back for $1.50. It'll make this package of wipes just 28 cents. And again, this is the 50 cent, the 56 count. So this is an amazing price for this package of Huggies wipes. And then right here, I have the Huggies smaller pack. So this is the package that is in the um, the um, the little travel section. And so these are priced at 97 cents. Fetch Rewards also has a rebate for this to where you can receive back 500 points, which is 50 cents. So they are priced at 97 cents. You will get back 50 cents from Fetch Rewards and that will make these just 47 cents. And this is the 16 count. Okay. Right here, I have the um, Skin to Mint Razor. This is the four pack. So this is priced at my store for $5.97. I did have a coupon that I printed from coupons.com about a week ago, and it was a $3 off coupon. So I used that coupon on here. And so that brought the total down to $2.97. And then Ibotta currently has a rebate back for $2. So I will pay $2.97 out of pocket, submit my receipt to Ibotta, and that will make this package of razors just 97 cents, which is an amazing price for some razors. Because you guys, regular price, $5.97, and you only pay 97 cents, that's an amazing deal. Okay, you guys. So, this right here was my uh, the first transaction that so I had. So, since the Campbell's didn't scan, I had to go back in the store and grab one more item in order to reach that $5 bonus. So, I went into the store and I grabbed these. And these are the Trolley Sour Crunchy Crawlers. And these are priced in Walmart for a dollar. Ibotta has a rebate back for $0.75 cents back. So, I'll pay a dollar out of pocket. Submit my receipt to Ibotta to get $0.75 cents back. That will make this package of candy just $0.25. Cents, and this is the 3.8 ounce. So what I did was, because I don't have my receipt for this. So what I did was I combined my total from this transaction plus this, which was only a dollar. I didn't get charged any taxes. And so I just combined both of those totals into one. Okay, so as you can see right here, my overall total for all of this came out to be $24.15 plus this dollar right here on the second receipt. So $25.15. And as you can see right here, I did use a um, $10 gift card that I redeemed from Fetch Rewards. So that brought my total down to $15.15. And from all of my, um, I bought a rebate offers right here, including the trolley candy, I got back a total of $9.69. Plus, I actually reached another bonus aside from the $5 bonus. I reached a 50 cent bonus. So I got back $9.69 plus a 50 cent bonus plus my $5 bonus for reaching um, 12 offers. So that brought my total to $15.19 plus the $2 that I got back from Fetch Rewards. Because remember, I got back $1.50 for that one and then I got back 50 cents for this one right here. So that's a total of $2 from Fetch Rewards. So I paid $15.15 out of pocket and I got back a total of $17.19. So for this entire transaction, it was completely free plus a $2.04 moneymaker. Now, I had someone comment to comment on my my one of my videos and say, well, it's, not techni it's technically not free because you used the gift card on it. And this is what I want to say. If I say it's free, it's free. If I didn't have to come out of my own pocket with the money is free for me okay however you do your couponing and whatever you consider free and don't consider free that's your business but this is what i consider free for me okay so just thought i'd get that out there if you guys enjoyed this video please give me a thumbs up if you have any questions feel free to leave them in the comment section below if you are not using ibotta i will have the link in the description box below 
along with my code on the screen for you guys. If you sign up using my code, you will receive $20 when you redeem your first rebate through Ibotta. And then also with Fetch Rewards, um, if you are not using Fetch Rewards, I will also have that linked in the description box below along with my code on the screen for you guys. Um, when you sign up using my code, you will receive 2,000 points, points, which is $2. So yeah, that's going to be pretty much it for this video, you guys. And I will see you guys in my next one. Mm -hmm.